Uh, defense didn't stop. You know, they stepped up to the plate, um, got us a big turnover, flex territory, just had to get, uh, didn't have to do that many yards for, for Chris to get through the upright. So, um, defense stepped up big tonight. Can you just talk us through your view on Chris's kick and uh, how you celebrated? Uh, I don't really like to watch kicks, so I kind of just listen. Um, but Chris talked about legacy all week and, and what was going to be the legacy of our 2024 team. Um, still have a lot to write, but he definitely left his legacy on the game tonight, so people remember that for a long time. Your first playing time in the Sunflower Showdown, what was that like? It was a, it was really fun, and it took me a while to get settled in and let all the nerves kind of get away from or get out of my system. But um, definitely still some room for improvement, but uh, it, was, it was a really fun opportunity, and, and the stadium, the bill was, was jumping tonight. So. What went through your head when you realized you dropped that ball? Um, I was really just trying to recover it. And it was, it was, I was reading for, to throw a, a, a RPO and the guy was kind of just in the window. So I was like, all right, just let's get back to the line of scrimmage. And I do a pump fake a million times. Uh, that time it just happened to slip, but you know, learn from it. And, um, it wasn't too terminal tonight, but obviously you don't want to turn the ball over, especially not in the red zone. You've talked about the love for your tight end group. Obviously a couple more touchdowns that night. Just what, well, what's been clicking, man, with the tight end group? Those dudes, uh, they do the dirty work and they get rewarded for it. So credit to you know our coaches for scheming up some good stuff and um, how they how they coach and the type of detail we try to get them to focus on in practice. And it, and it just continues to show as, it, as we step onto the field for the games. Just how big was this one? Um, I wouldn't say, I'd say it's, it's big just because it's a conference game. We have to continue to, to win our conference games if we want to play for that Big 12 championship at the end of the year. But I mean, it's not bigger than any, in um, any win. It's not bigger than the win we had last week. So, Avery, as the offense, I guess, struggles to score in the fourth quarter, the defense comes up with turnover and then a couple stops. Uh, that defense's resilience when you guys need plays for the offense. How important is that for you guys? Uh, it's it's really big, and like like we always say, you know, it's a team sport, and they stepped up big tonight, and and they really uh, they pulled their weight in in some of ours in that fourth quarter so credit to those guys for how they prepare during the week and you know how much time they spend um, getting ready for their opponents and you know we're really really disciplined and well grouped bunch so those guys just just went out there and, and did what they were supposed to do um, and they, that's what they knew they could do so um, credit to those guys for for winning us this game tonight. Kind of success 